Hi everybody, I started biking outside today for my training for the Mind Aid 2023 Bike Ride Across Canada. So happy about that. It's March, mid-March, and I did a bike ride the other day, and uh, two days ago, and then a bike ride today. 40 kilometers each time. It's nice to be outside. I started late January in the gym, and it's uh, on the stationary bike, rowing machine. I did do some laps around the track, uh, indoor track where the gym is. But it's nice to be outside on the bike. I'm not much of one for the stationary bike, never have been, but I will say now that I'm training to bike across Canada, the stationary bike did become easier. I did stay on, stay on it longer than I wanted to, uh, or not lo longer than I thought I would. Um, I take breaks in the gym. I take breaks from stationary bike to rowing machine to track. I just sort of break it up. And when I get bored of one, I try another, but I was impressed with myself. I stayed on the stationary bike longer than I than I thought I would. I usually last about three minutes, five minutes, and I just get so bored. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it is nice to be outside. I will say that it's warm. Well, warm for southern Canada at this time of year. Uh, mid March, it's like seven degrees Celsius, so a bit above freezing. Uh, sunny. It's spring is in the air, and I'm just makes me look forward to the trip this summer. And yeah. Looking forward to meeting people along the way, meeting other people with schizophrenia, their families, people with mental illness, people in the mental health care, uh, professionals. Looking forward to the events and uh, raising some money and funds for the schizophrenia societies and the MindAid nonprofits to help people with mental illness in developing countries. Really looking forward to this. So I've been doing some weights too, um, a little bit of weights as well. So excited about that. It feels good to be getting back in shape. Uh, I biked across Canada before I got sick with schizophrenia at the age of 20. Wanted to do more fun stuff like that, but got schizophrenia at 22 and just couldn't do regular exercise again. And to be honest, the last couple months of training that I've done, well, almost a couple months, it's the most volume of exercise, regular exercise I've done in since the trip, really. Uh, about 30 years or so and it feels awfully nice to just get up on the bike and go and yeah it's not super warm so it's it's a, it can be a little cool on the bike outside but it's a lot better than being indoors right now and but uh, it's just nice to have that, mo that motivation if I want to do something I just get up and do it it's a real treat instead of sitting there lying lying there thinking I don't want to do this how am I going to do this you have this big internal battle in your head, and it's just so nice to have that gone. If I want to do something, I just get up and do it. If I want to call someone, I just get up and call them. It's a real treat, and I would love to make that possible for more people. I know there's so many people out there who are lying in bed, having that internal battle, that struggle to get up and do stuff, and I, I'm trying to make that possible for more people to, to not have that anymore, to be free. Wouldn't it be nice if everyone was free? Just totally free, unencumbered. <sighs> so, anyway, that's my uh, thoughts for today. And looking forward to uh, making more videos, letting you know more what's going on with the trip. And, yeah, thanks so much, everybody.